Hey guys, today we're going to talk about one of my favorite standard speculations, and it is Yugamog, the ceaseless one. I like him a lot at $10, $11, I think he's 13 on TCG mids. Fantastic card, has a lot of relevant abilities, has a enter the battlefield ability, which is always nice. I exiles two target permanents. It's indestructible. Yes, it does cost a whole lot, but at the end of the day, it is worth that amount. From standard ramp, always people always want to play ramp. Ramp is much from GP Houston. This was one of the most popular cards that vendors wanted to buy. From that point in time, that deck no longer exists as a tier one deck or a tier one concept. Ramping into the Ceaseless One is no longer popular. So he has dropped significantly since that time. And you can buy copies of him on TCG Player for $12, $11. His TCG mid is $13 right now. On eBay, you can get playsets for around $40 with shipping. I like the card. I believe it is one of those casual cards or EDH cards or that it has upside in standard, but should it never spike again, I have no problem just holding on to it. First of all, it's a Drazi, people like that. It's kind of like a mythic angel, but instead of being angel, it's just this giant creature being, supreme being or something like that. I like it a lot. I think it's extremely powerful, and right now it is underpriced for its potential and its longevity. I see it as a long-term speculation, and one day he could be a $25, $35 card again, um, given enough time and assuming there's no reprints. The Adrazi are extremely popular in EDH's, and I think once we go back to Zendikar again, because we'll probably go there another time, his price will spike at that point, because people will be making more Adrazi decks. I like him a lot. He's a very low price right now. Might be worth trading into a few or picking up your playset. Or at least your single copy, right, for EDH.